June 17, 2005, nang dumayo sa Amerika si Bobby the Sniper Pacquiao upang sagupain ang Nooy WBC Continental America Super Featherweight Champion na si Carlos Navarro. Si Carlos Navarro nga po ang isa sa tumalo kay Floyd Mayweather Jr. noong sila ay mga amateur boxer pa. At bago nga ang laban kay Bobby Pacquiao ay galing sa dalawang impresibong panalo si Carlos Navarro. Ito nga ay nang talunin niya ang isa pa nating kababayan na si Luisito Espinosa sa pamamagitan ng 7th round TKO. At si Agapito Sanchez na kilala natin na pinakamadayang nakalaban ng ating pambansang kamao, ito nga ay tinayo niya rin by 11th round TKO. Habang si Bobby Pacquiao naman ay galing noon sa talo sa isang Thai boxer. Bago ang laban ng dalawa ay may kartada si Carlos Navarro na 25 wins, 3 losses, 1 draw at may 20 KO. Habang ang ating kababayan naman na si Bobby Pacquiao ay may record noon na 33 wins, 10 losses, 3 draw at may 16 KO. Sa laban nilang ito ay sinabi ni Teddy Atlas na isa sa mga commentator sa laban na lamang na lamang daw si Carlos Navarro sa bakbakan. My prediction, Navarro. Sa unang dalawang rounds ay nahirapan makasabay si Bobby Pacquiao dahil nga madulas na sapatos ang naisuot nito. right away but it was suggested you can hear them talking in the corner about maybe grabbing a can of soda like a cola and a sticky syrupy substance and putting that under the shoes but they were unable to do that obviously in just the 60 seconds they had to work with Teddy. Some of the things that we were talking about then as you're limited to what you can come up against a slip again you're limited and in football games where there's weather that affects maybe the cleat that a team is using and you'll see a team really suffer through a first quarter or even a half before they go to a longer cleat not a lot of time to waste and deal with situations like this in boxing you're caught out there many times in situations like this you talked about what can you do the coca-cola is one of the ideas of course guys if that you see this problem with the shoes exaggerated much more it's a little right hook see i think i see a little adjustment by pacquiao and i give him credit he's taking shorter steps he's going to keep from throwing those punches that are going to number two and still Pacquiao trying to deal with the footing. Tough go of it through two rounds. Bago magsimula ang round three ay naisipan ng corner ni Bobby Pacquiao na lagyan ng tape ang sapatos nito para mawala ang pagkadulas ng sapatos. The side of the tape is now wrapped around the bottom of the soles for Bobby Pacquiao. And he suffered through two rounds of slipping and sliding. Let's see if this works. Situation. That's about the best thing you could come up with. Probably what I would have tried. 
Teddy, they were able to get the front of the foot. They weren't able to get the heel of the pot. Actually, he had pulled himself together. Veteran Carlos Navarro, he was knocked out by Nate Campbell in 2002. Took all of 2003 off, and now three straight wins as he comes into this fight against Bobby Pacquiao. And even though the good nip and tuck fight, Navarro in spots showing that he's a little sharp, but again, as I mentioned earlier, has more options. He can count Pacquiao, but for the most part, is a little one-dimensional, walking straight forward. Great amateur career from Navarro. You can see a cut under the right eye of Bobby Pacquiao now. Happened moments ago on that exchange in the middle. I don't know if it was from a flash. We'll get a ruling. Matapos mapuruan sa bodega sa round 6, ay bigla ngang napaluhod si Carlos Navarro. Ngunit imbis na bilangan ay pinagpahinga pa ito ng referee dahil low blow daw ang suntok ni Bobby Pacquiao. Pagdating ng round 7 ay hindi na nga pinagbigyan ni Bobby Pacquiao si Navarro at nagpaulan na nga ito ng 1 to 1 suntok sa kalaban. Sometimes that counts more than Let it go, let it go, Jose. Bobby Pacquiao's got lots. 
lots of momentum. What an interesting seventh round it's been. Still all twists and turns. Still opportunities don't put. The battle to punch in between these strong wide punches. He takes a knee for the third time in this round. No matter what his technique and what his ability to counter in between, it doesn't matter. Sa panalong iyon ay naagaw ni Bobby Pacquiao ang WBC Continental America's title at pinatunayan lang nito na hindi siya basta-bastang kalaban. Bago tayo matapos ay shoutout muna sa ating mga tagapanood. Hanggang dito na lang mga boss, sana nagustuhan nyo ang ating video. Salamat sa panonood.